Hi, this is Manuel, Delta Lima 2, Mike Alpha November. Welcome back to my channel. Maybe you're one of the guys who thought, hey, I don't care if uh, I don't get firmware updates, I don't miss anything. Um, I mean, what can they what can they do with the firmware that I can't do already with what's installed? Well, today's the day you're going to regret buying an Anorig or whatever fake is out there. Um, because there is a major update coming. Um, right now available for you to download as beta. <laughs> of course, only if you have an official version that is supported. And uh, yeah, I'm going to walk you through that and I think you're going to be as excited as I am about the improvements because Guido has made the impossible possible. He squeezed out every last bit of it to make something happen that I thought was impossible. But let's see. When scrolling through the menu, you don't see much news. Um, there is one exception. And this is uh, 4.2 CQ message. There's additional CW message for you to program if you like that. And another thing is after seeing the version number 2.00 Tango in this uh, case that we can now continue to scroll through. We don't need to go all the way back. The major improvement was made um, inside so the way Guido saved some space uh, deleted unneeded uh, unused code unnecessary code made things more compact more efficient and uh, by default now cut streaming is enabled this means uh, cut speed is also increased now by default like i think 115 200 baud um, keep that in mind when trying out that firmware but now <laughs> for the main aspect if I press and hold menu, look what happens. I can see spectrum scope in real time. Um, I'm going to demonstrate that now because there is a little bit to, to consider when using this feature. In this case, you can see it's in real time. You can really see what's happening around you in real time. Now, if I enable audio so you can hear something, Going to zoom in for you. Now you can hear, once I press that, audio is muted. When I now start scrolling, there will be a reduced rate, reduced refresh rate, but audio will be back on in reduced quality. We needed to do this in order, it's basically a workaround because the Atmega is so busy doing uh, its thing, receiving that there was not uh, enough power to make it happen at the same time. So we needed to have a compromise. Now you can hear cluck, 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 cluck. That's the display refresh rate. You can hear now, this is a reduced thing. Uh, reduced audio quality with reduced refresh rate of the spectrum scope but only while scrolling once the first time you press and hold menu it's going to be in real time so you see oh yeah there's a strong station oh yeah see what just happened my steps are 100 kilohertz i'm going now to kilohertz steps we have still plus minus 32 kilohertz range but now I can scroll down here. The refresh rate is now way slower, but I can see there's a lot of stations around me. I'm now going to uh, reduce the step rate to uh, 0.5 kilohertz. You can see now the bandwidth of the spectrum scope is also reduced. Now I can tune fine in. See, if I reduce that further, I can now even zoom further in. 
Okay, it's getting a little bit chaotic here. But the same is true, vice versa. Once I increased the step rate, the bandwidth is also increased. That's how that works. In this context, I need to mention that in order to make that happen, we needed to sacrifice the modes AM and FM, no longer available here. But they were not implemented uh, very well anyway, so we sacrificed it for the spectrum scope. If you like that, please try it, if you like to try it, and give us some feedback. I will put you a link in the description below the video where you can uh, give us the feedback around that firmware version, beta version 2.00 Tango. Remember, this is still only an 8-bit microcontroller, an uh, Atmega 328. Can you imagine that he made it possible? That's incredible. I'm, I'm, I'm overwhelmed by that. Um, yeah, I hope you like that and please give us feedback. See you next time. 73. Bye-bye.